on the last part. Delicious boomerang, come to me. Come back here. And now we continue. Hey everybody, Rainriker here, and welcome back to yet another part of Subnautica. Now as you might notice, I do not have my webcam down in the corner there. That is because I've been noticing that I've been having some desyncing issues with the audio. Uh, there's just something going on with this camera, I don't know what it is, I'm trying to get it figured out, hopefully that'll be up and running before too long, I just got a t-shirt. Mmm, delicious. Uh, okay, so. I have also made quite a bit of uh, strides in technology here on my ship. I did the grinding out to get things that I needed without really just wasting time because honestly it was just going around and collecting like quartz and stuff, which isn't all that interesting. Uh, in addition to the camera thing, I will try to get this back up and running. Uh, this is going to be one part recording thing, I'm not going to do a session of it. So, I'm gonna go ahead and show people around this ship. Um, now, things that have changed since the last part is uh, these plant pots. I have pretty much solved my food issue. I can just sit here and collect all these potatoes and just eat them and they, uh, eventually I can just put one back and it will plant and these things grow pretty quick, so it shouldn't be much of an issue. Uh, there's a little like percentage thing. I don't know if there's one here. It looks like they're all fully grown so these things do grow very fast but it'll give you a little percentage timer and they take maybe like five to ten minutes to actually grow. Uh, they got a few more storage lockers. I for whatever reason cannot place some up here so this is probably gonna be other space for something else. Uh, I got my battery charger up and running and filling up batteries. The cool thing about this ship is it defies the laws of physics and I can actually charge batteries way faster than they deplete. So whenever I need to uh, switch out a battery, I just come up here, I just grab one of these guys, come back over, switch this, and swap them out. And then I can just go back and plug the other one into the charger when needed. Uh, where are you? There you go. Okay, so that guy is now charging. Uh, there's about six in this thing, and whoa, what is this? Access upgrade mod. Oh, this is right, I can actually upgrade this thing. I completely forgot about that. Uh, so, yes, these are little upgrade things I can plug into. Uh, those are crafted items, and we'll get to those in a second. I'm trying to get through everything here. Uh, it does go down, so after this one depletes, it'll go to the next, and the next, and it'll go to the other side. I have never really had that happen. Uh, next, I have my fish tank here. I just wanted some little bit of company, so I got my, my Abali guy here. I got my little... I don't know what these guys are, but they look cool. Uh, my sunfish. He looks pretty much like a sunfish. He's pretty much one. And then whatever the heck this thing is. It's like a, what, I forget what it was called. It's a uh, hoverfish. I got a hoverfish in there. I also have been playing around with my terraformer. I don't remember if I got that in the last part or while I was grinding, but that is a thing and uh, I can go and uh, show how that works in a minute here. But we actually have a little mission going on right now. Uh, in addition to everything else, I also have this, the modification station. And this lets us go ahead and like upgrade our stuff. So one thing I want to do is, okay, so extra light tank. I don't know what that does, probably nothing right now. Uh, but I want the high capacity tank that lets me breathe more. So I'm going to need my O2 tank and titanium, which actually we should have quite a bit of. I was trying to just collect as much resource as possible just so I could uh, get things all up and running. I just didn't want to really like uh, hunt around as much. So yeah, go ahead and craft up my tank. And I'm not sure how much that uh, lets me breathe now. I think originally it was like 75. Can I just drop down here? I could not. Close that. Huh? I'm just gonna take a quick look at how long I have. So 105 now, that is a significant uh, increase to what I used to be able to do. I want one of these guys. Come here. Ah, gotcha. I'm also right next to a thermal vent. I thought this was kind of neat. I think this might have been the heat signature. No, the heat signature is still pretty far away. But I do uh, just happen to have this thermal vent nearby. Welcome aboard, Captain. Well, I thank you, submarine. Online. Excellent. Okay, so I'm gonna th go ahead and throw this fish into the tank quick. Where is he? There he is. Boom, now I got a full tank of fish. 
Ah, oh, look at him, he's adorable. Okay, so what else we got? We have fins, we have ones that increase my swim speed, we have ones that charge my stuff. I think I'm gonna go with the increased swimming speed because I think uh, just getting it in and out of places quicker would be better. I do not know if I have any silicon rubber though. I could, I can make one. Uh, yeah, I don't think. It looks like I just have the two here. Nope, I don't want that. What is that even? Grub basket. I don't, even, I don't even know what that plant is. Uh, I'm gonna load this area up with this stuff since I don't need it right now. And I'll go ahead and make the. Yeah, eat that. Go ahead and make the silicon rubber for this. Basic materials and silicon rubber. There we go. And I'll go ahead and I want to just drop it at that here, I guess. So we're gonna need more silicon rubber. In addition to what? What else do we want to make? We would like to make. I don't even have a propulsion cannon yet. Cyclops. Uh, I need. Why does that require so much plasteel ingot? Just makes it stronger. Uh. I can't even read this. It's like going off the screen. How about this? There we go. Okay, so hardens the vehicle, makes it stronger. Hardens the vehicle, makes it stronger. And that is just for the Seamoth? Weird. Alright, so. Uh, I want to get down. I don't. Do How much salt do we have? I don't. Okay, we have two salt right there. So that's 80 water. I keep hitting escaped back out of stuff. I really got to stop doing that. Yeah, we don't have a lot of salt left. I don't know how much water we have. Uh, that's health kits. Oh, never mind. We have a lot of water. Huh. I'm gonna take one. Should probably also put these quartz back into a locker somewhere. Yeah, go ahead and drop these guys. What is this battery? 100% charged battery. Oh, that's for my sea glide. Okay, go ahead and plug that into there. Stay away from that thermal vent. I don't want to get toasted. It's cool. But uh, in addition to everything I've been making, I also made Welcome this. Aboard, this is the moon pool, which allows us to upgrade our sea moth, which now has a new paint job, as well as a new name. I forget what I named it. I called it the Bodie McBoat. It's gonna call it Bodie McBoatface, but I didn't have the space, unfortunately. Alrighty, Bodie McBoat. Uh, this is just to change kind of the settings of it, the colors and whatnot. This is the crafting. So we can, let's see here. Pressure compensator, I think, uh, how many things can we upgrade this? I think it was four. It's probably four. Uh, yes, it is four. So this thing has four little slots that we can get into and put stuff into there. Generates a localized electric field to our designated ward off aggressive fauna. That's not super bad. Because that's just an advanced wiring kit. Displaying uh, topographical data. It's also not a bad thing. Torpedo system. Magnetite and computer chip. That's what I, I really want more offensive stuff. So I think I'm gonna go for that. And to see if I have what it takes to make a computer chip, I think it was silver, what was it? Silver, crystal, and something else. Silver, crystal, let me let me look that up quick. Brain coral, that's what it was. Table, table coral. So silver, okay, got a silver ore. Uh. Quartz, quartz. Is that the table coral? Yeah. All of these. And a quartz. So I'm gonna go ahead and make a... Oh, I need two of those, okay. Makes sense, I guess. Okay, so there's a computer chip. I needed something else. What else did I need? Completely forgot to even... 
I probably said it, but I did not retain the information. I wish I could have one of these guys. They're so cool. They're adorable. I didn't know a fish could be adorable, but it is. I want to pet it. Okay, so it was magnetite. That's what it was. And I'm pretty sure I have a few magnetite laying around from one of my misadventures. Okay. Where am I? I'm starting to lose track. I'm traveling around places so quick, I don't even know. Uh, magnetite, magnetite. I don't even know what that looks like. Was that a crystal? Uh. Ah, magnetite. That's what that was. Okay. Actually, you know, I don't remember what it takes to make it. I think it was just titanium, but I just want to make sure. Okay. So let's go ahead and make an upgrade. Uh, power efficiency. Mm, that's also not that bad. I need the pressure compensator, though. Those are the two I, I definitely need. Okay, that is a torpedo module. Get over here. No, 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 no. I did not. Get back up in there. Come on. Okay, it's not letting me in. So I'm gonna have to go out. Oh, hey, actually, I could probably just grab some of these things and make those fins quick. I did not actually remember that I was this close. And... Eh, you know what, I'll grab one more. Why not? There we go. Get back up into this moon pool. Yeah, there we go. Audio did not play. That is A-OK. -okay. Access upgrades. Where is my upgrade? Where is it? Ah, there it is. All right, cool. So we got torpedoes in there. What does it take to make tor uh, torpedoes? Okay, I need a computer chip and a plasteel ingot for that, which shouldn't be an issue. Uh, torpedoes. Vortex torpedoes. Hmm. So they just take titanium. Okay, that shouldn't be an issue. Sploosh. All right. That. Oh, that's just the bunny again. Bunny fish. Adorable little bunny fish. Uh, okay. Did I get a shirt thing? I probably drank it already. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and make that rubber. Yeah, rubber. Never get enough of that rubber. Give me my these. Go ahead and make those. Excellent. So now I am faster in addition to everything else. Uh, let's see here. I do need uh, another one of these. Okay, I, I have some titanium on me right now. I just have to craft it quick. Quartz. Uh, I do need one of these uh, ingots, though. And then I need lithium. How many lithium do I have? Do I have any lithium? Glass. It does not appear that I have any lithium. That is unfortunate. I guess I'm going to have to go out and get lithium, which... Hopefully, it shouldn't be too much of an issue. Go ahead and make that computer chip, though. And go up here, get my titanium. And, you know, I'm going to grab, like, uh, I don't know, two more, just in case. So, how fast am I? Eh, I'm, I'm decently fast, I guess. And I, I breathe way longer, so it shouldn't be too much of an issue. Okay. So how do I put the uh, torpedoes in there once I make them, I wonder? Oh, dang. I make three at a time? That's crazy. So I have nine torpedoes now. 
My ship is now black. I do not want it to be black. There we go. Make it easier to see. How do I put the torpedoes in you? Is it like... Right here? How do I put torpedo in you? Does it just take them from my inventory? I have torpedo in here. Load this into the torpedo bay on the forward section of your Seamoth. How do I do that, though? Can I just jump onto my Seamoth and do that? Ah. Where is this? Torpedo bay, torpedo bay. Yeah, I'm gonna drop it quick. Let's see if maybe I have a better chance of accessing. Oops. All right, we're good. Everything's fine. Oh, stay away from the thermal vent. All right, let's see here. Can I access you now? Yeah, tor 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 bleh, torpedo bay. Okay. Well, I'm gonna test it out, actually, because I'm curious. Huh? Oh, jeez. I was not expecting it to make a black hole. Shoot the bunny! Well, ain't that something. All right, let's go refill this quick. There we go. I'm gonna try to shoot some fauna quick when, uh, get the opportunity to do so, but I need that lithium. It is very important to me that I have the lithium. What? Oh my. Is this new? I don't ever remember seeing this before. I swear I've been over here. Whoops. Bumping into stuff. Prepare to meet your maker, sir. Oh yeah? Is that what you think? Ah, how do you like that? Yeah. What's that noise? Uh, lithium, lithium. I forget where lithium spawns even. What am I hitting? Radiation detected. Oh dear. Let's get out of here. All right. Well, let's go check out what's going on with the trip. I wonder if I can blow these up. Oh. Nope. Oh, those are rigid. That's a shame. I thought it'd be so cool if those like just all detonated. Do do do. Okay, so I'm on the edge of the. Grassy biome, I think. Yeah, okay, so that's the that's the bloodgrass biome. So I think on the other side of this should be the mushroom biome. I don't know what this pillar is. Uh no, that's just more grass biome. I'm pretty sure there's something over here though. Let's see. What the hell is that? Hold on. Hey. Get out of here. Whoa. Jeez, hold on. There is something out there. What is that? What are you doing, sir? Hey. There. Just launch you off into no man's land. Maybe that's how he made it out there. I just launched him. Jesus Christ. The thing is huge. 
Uh, okay, well, I'm not going that direction, that's for sure. Jeez. Maybe I should get a closer look. Maybe. Maybe I should just continue having really bad ideas. Oh man, I should actually fix up my ship some. Do I even have my welder on me? I do. Oh god. That would have been a very bad time, gotta say. What? <gasps> Wait a minute. <gasps> lithium! Oh, I found lithium! Oh, yes, 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 yes! Oh, okay, so we found our lithium, finally. Oh man, what biome is this? Aren't those just the reeds or whatever? That is ridiculous. All right, so I'm gonna collect a whole lot of this lithium, as much as I can possibly get my hands on, without dying horribly, because I know there are hostile enemies over here, and I don't know how well my gun is doing. I should probably equip it. There we go. Shouldn't really need the welder, I don't think. Uh, whoa, calm down there, metal. Man, I wish I could have like a little aquarium, because I wish I could steal one of these things. I'm gonna get a closer look at him, actually. Wow, aren't you cool? You're neat. I like you. Maybe it just does, or it does just spawn in this biome. Cause I was like right on the floor next to him. Yeah, like there's some right here too. I should really get back. Uh oh. Oh, that's not good. Caution. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. <sighs> okay, we're good, we're good. That was almost a really bad time. But now, and since I uh, am a little bit faster and I do have extended amounts of breathing time, I should be able to just like park here and go get those. Oops, missed completely. Excellent. Uh... Let's see, anything else here? Not really. All right, heading out. Whoa, no, I did not hit tab. Oh, you know what, I probably hit the uh, missile pod bay, didn't I? Yeah, I did. All right, good to go. I am super curious about that freaking like, sea monster, though. It was, there, that thing was huge, because it was really far away. And it was as big as it looked far away as it is as... I cannot talk right now. It's big monster, very spooky. I do not like it one bit. Alrighty, and we're back. What did I hit? Welcome aboard, Captain. There we go. Okay, with my pockets full of lithium, I can now start crafting some crazy stuff. So Welcome I needed. All systems online. Uh, I'm gonna actually drop off some of this stuff. Well, I got a lot of lithium. Jeez. Okay, so I'm gonna make some plastic ingots quick. Yeah. Amazing. Caution. Blood nutrient levels decreasing. Okay. No. stabilizing. No. Just eat all this potato. There we go. And then I can plant this one. Whoops. Well, that's not good. Luckily I have three of these plants because I was afraid that might happen. There we go. Put some of this water back. And yeah, that's gonna give you a percentage, or at least it should. Yeah, 1%. So I think I needed a computer chip? Yeah. Uh, you know what? I think lithium counts as a metal enough. Put this in here. Oh, I have a computer chip, actually. Well then, we're good to go. And this is dead, in, dead in the water. I forgot. 
Okay. Whoops. Okay. Friggin' Seamoth. Prepare to get compensated. Excellent. So now I can finally stop dealing with all these little messages saying, whoa, pressure depth, blah, blah, we're gonna die. Go away. Splish. All right, so what else can we do? Don't really want a storage model, or module. It's four by four, but I don't know. Could be useful. Only takes titanium. Uh, Power efficiency could be good. Um, I haven't had a problem with it though. I'm gonna give it a whole reinforcement quick. Gotta swap out that battery. You know, I'm gonna I'm gonna unload it right here. And that there we go. Go ahead and. Take this one out, put this one in. There we go. See how nice that is? How are we doing on battery in here? That one's a 100%. 74, eh, yeah, I'll let that run a little bit longer. No harm. So I need, uh, I'll take a bunch of titanium, I don't remember how much I needed. Down here. And pretty soon here we will have a fully modified Seamon. Yeah. For reinforcement and storage module. Because you know what? I can take them out, so it's not that big of a deal. There we go. Whole reinforcement and yeah. So where's the storage? Right there. Oof da. Yeah, that's not so bad. I can put like tools and stuff in there. Okay, well. I think that's gonna complete this part, so thank you for watching. If you like this part and you wanna see other things I've done, go ahead and leave a like, comment, subscribe, do whatever you wanna do, and I'll catch you in the next part. Have a good one.